talking about how Moroccan Darija language is influenced by the unique history, values, beliefs, and the environment, and how it differs from modern standard Arabic. Language is a form of communication, and culture expresses itself through communication. Some ways culture influences communication may be found through the fact that there are large language barriers. For example, English language and the way of thinking associated with it makes it difficult to understand when coming from an Asian-speaking culture. This comes about from our vastly different ideologies and philosophies. For example, United States citizens tend to be direct in our speaking habits, while Asiatic cultures are indirect and focus on saving face rather than calling someone out. Power distance comes into play when communicating from Asiatic countries as well, while U.S. citizens tend to approach individuals directly and treat each other as equals. Chinese, for instance, use the logarith logograms for words rather than an alphabet to create words like many Western languages, and each logogram has specific meaning. Conversely, the country of Morocco uses Maghrebi Arabic with influences by Berber, French, and Spanish for their alphabet. These facts come from Lecture 4 in Com 263 and the CIA World Factbook. The of the country and is considered a more casual way to communicate with each other in day-to-day -day situations. For more professional situations, standard Arabic is used according to Darija, the evolution of oral Arabic in Morocco. The Journal of North Africa Studies states that Darija differs from the standard Arabic mostly in phonetics along with grammar, vocabulary, and pronunciation. Moroccan Darija is a direct language and uses past and present pretenses just as English does, such as for the past, like he did ride the bike, whereas present tense would say he is riding the bike. There are, the, there are three subcategories or varieties of Darija, Rifia, which is in the north, Socia in the south, and Shelha in the middle Atlas Mountains. Differences between Moroccan Arabic and Standard Arabic. Plus one common idioms used in the Arabic language. Hafafa damu. This literally means he lightened his blood. In Arabic, this phrase means that somebody who is considered a clown or an idiot stopped being a clown or an idiot. Number two. Allah aini wa rasi. On my head and my eyes. This is a hugely popular saying in the Arab world. So if you ask an Arab friend for a favor, don't be surprised when they start talking about putting things on their heads and eyes. This means that they will absolutely do what you ask. Kiss yiblaak. This literally means, may a vagina swallow you. This phrase is something that someone would say to somebody who they do not like or are unpleased with. Laaba el hadid. He played iron. Possibly evidence that fitness culture isn't taken very seriously in the Middle East. This expression is used to mean he lifted weights or worked out. This is retrieved from Henry I. Eight idioms only Arabs understand. Moroccan Arabic is also known as Daraja. It's only spoken in non-official situations. Moroccans are raised in a high power distance setting where they are taught to be professional when needed. Morocco is a territory that has been in constant war and was conquered by many, including France and Spain. It is different from regular Arabic because it, it has been influenced by the French and Spanish language. Language defines experience and influences how and what someone thinks. Lecture 4, 2018. For example, the Moroccan language has been altered based on living conditions and locations. Retrieved from Daraja, the evolution of oral Arabic in Morocco. Thank mm -hmm. you.